My name is Hanifa. I'm 14 years old and I'm from Mundelein. By 6.35, we're all out the house, headed to the train. My name is Sanchez. I am 12 years old and I am from Inglewood. I always have to go to school a little early because I either have to catch up on some work, choir, or maybe go in for early math help. We take the train to Linden, and then we take the bus from Linden to Locust. Then we walk to Regina. The fact of getting used to like, being on my own, like it's helping me prepare for my future in life. I do love choir. It's one of my favorite things to do. What made me apply to, for a scholarship to Boys Hope, Girls Hope, was that my older brother, Santonio, kept saying it was nice there and fun and you meet a lot of interesting people. My little brother, Sanchez. Honestly, I see a lot of resemblance. He's in seventh grade, much more ambitious than I was at that time and truly sees the big picture. I kind of like the school that I go to now, St. A's. We have a lot of clubs, like I'm in student council and I do basketball, so it's pretty nice. Boys Hope, Girls Hope is a competitive scholarship program serving young men and women who are academically gifted but lack economic resources. We accept scholars as young as middle school and support them all the way through high school, college, and into career entry. Since 1989, we have maintained a 100% high school graduation rate, and our college graduation rate is 75%. My favorite topic of conversation at the dinner table is our alumni and alumna base. Santonio San came to Boys Hope Girls Hope in 2008, and from the moment he walked through the door, he was driven. He has that internal grit that we look for in scholars. When I was five years old, my dad received his third strike and was sentenced to 14 years in prison. Coming from the south side of Chicago, it's a pretty isolated area that lacks a ton of resources. I visited Loyola, Shadowed, um, stay at the program for a day overnight, and I loved it. I was like, this is it. This is what I've been looking for my whole life. Most recently, the project that I've been a part of is teaching financial literacy. It's one way that I give back. Another example of an amazing Boys Hope Girls Hope alum is Misha Lay. Misha Lay came to our program in 2008. I have always wanted to be a teacher. I remember back in second grade, my teacher asked me what I wanted to be when I grow up, and the first thing I ever said was a teacher, and it's never changed since. I really appreciate Boys Hope Girls Hope because um, they really make college a reality for me. No one in my family had gone to college. I was the first to go. So Boys Hope Girls Hope really walked me through that process. I went to Marquette University and I graduated in 2016. What's significant about this school is I actually went here. I just always wanted to give back to the network of schools that made me fall in love with learning and love school. Right now I like to study dance. Orcasis is basically a dance club, but it's like mainly student choreographed. I'm not really sure what I want to study, but I know that I want to minor in dance and maybe go into the medical field. My name is Deshanti. I'm 17 and I'm from South Chicago. My greatest challenge was probably getting used to how fast things move. I wouldn't say that you grow up fast, but you learn life skills at a faster rate than most people your age. 
Usually everyone's in a pretty good mood for dinner. Just the energy of everyone being together. Kind of fun, we laugh and talk. My name is Daniel. I'm 17 years old and I'm from Flossmoor, Illinois. I think my favorite part of the program is just getting to like share the space with a bunch of different characters. Once you get to know people, then it's just like another loving like family that you have. Between dinner and study, usually we do our chores and the chores can be ranging from cleaning the bathroom to taking out the trash. The chore that I have right now is, in my opinion, the worst chore, which is dishes. <laughs> and it's a lot. We study from seven to nine. I already know what college I want to go to. Wisconsin, like the one my brother went to. I want to become a doctor or a lawyer. I think being here is really fun, as long as you put in enough effort, you'll receive just as much as you put in. Boys Hope Girls Hope taught me to not be afraid to step out of my comfort zone. Boys Hope Girls Hope to me means opportunity. I'd say helpful. Family. Family. To the supporters, I would just like to say thank you because there is no Santonio, San there is no Sanchez, there is no breaking the cycle without your support and contributions.